Well, it's basically a um, Bible school. You teach you different different aspects of just how to look on life differently based through the Bible and how it could affect your life and the, just the lead things where the world put out to you. Like one of our classes, uh, our identity in Christ. You know, it got you this whole program about just how the world the world put it as in you have to be this person or you have to you have to have these things to make you be successful you know and then god said that he called the least to be the greatest in his kingdom and it just really broadened your aspects because most of the times we have a very narrow view of life and we don't look at all the other different things you know and god are like what i don't know a narrow-minded god you know i broad and you have to really like think about all this crazy stuff when he put like in front of your face and it, it just oh my gosh we had so much different class we based some of our classes on books and different stuff through studying the bible like you get a better or wider aspect of life like that material things that only for a while you know and that you know you can't do anything you can't do anything without god and like no God real, you know, and uh, I say, I witness the power of prayer, you know, that, that God real, so if you pray to Him, and that's all He asks for, just prayers, you know, and that um, young people, this, this day and age could just, like, reach out to Him, because that's what we want, you know, He want a generation where I just call out to Him, and, you know, and by studying this, this um, do this course, that us open up my eyes to a lot of things. You know. We have... We've been studying the um, the human trafficking trade. You know, Belize are the second, you know, second phase or whatever. It's really crazy that human trafficking go go through our country. You know, and people put it down as an oh, that was small thing, but really they're not. You know, we gone through all these studies about girls, how they're being trafficked, and what the terror when they go through. You know, and I think that we really should have put that out there because it troubled my heart to know that girls my age and younger. They got you all this crazy stuff and um it really hard you know but that that made a life-changing class because it make you look on the world like oh my gosh you have a lot of new peoples coming from you know my descent, chinese descent, and you don't know how they get there or, or you know they work on a state and it just make you really look on that as in or oh, i open it you look on it broader like yo you know <laughs> all this crazy stuff um you no know, for me you know i that, like a shy person like I know I talk to people I know know her I know open up to people and they are just just open my eyes to that that um that that way they how I'm in the live that know that not the way God want I live you know and that to just leave all of that behind for God that you know you know the Bible they say if you look for life you will lose it and if you left your life for God you will find it and I think I well I don't think I know I find my life, you know, who I supposed to be in a Christ. Like when Marika said about your identity in Christ, I I find that and yeah, that may a tough thing because you have to work with each other. You can't just say I will do it put it put it for yourself because you know that you can't do it alone and you need each other and that the whole island, you know.